Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Darkest Dungeon in the Maximum Effort Estate. We are gonna go up against the Swine God, level 5 champion. We get this Guts Dragon Slayer, which is a pretty decent weapon. 20% damage is nice, it's more than you usually find on a weapon. But then minus dodge is meh. And then Wilbur's Flag is a set one that it's better than the Stun Resist Ring that we already use on the Thrall chassis so this is a good uh, item which is nice we are gonna try to take down the swine guard we have Keechan the second who has Warren's Explorer and other good things he has a beast slayer's ring and a lightsaber Yuli is still gonna be running without trinkets um, because of the natural thing here and I still think that that is sort of okay it's not perfect, but he is a super tank because of the withstand ability, so, you know, and then having high HP and high healing received makes for a de decent combo, at least. So here we go into Caradox. Caradox has the Dovakin's Wind Shear and then Swine Head, and he has two diseases, so he gets up to uh, 30, 30 extra from this specific trinket in critical chance, which is uh, amazing. And then he's really good against the mark thing. Uh, yeah, I forgot about that. But we will have to brand with him and then go vindicate or alternate between them. Hmm. So we don't have any other in the party that really uses marks except Kitchen, but he's not even running the marked ability. So you will have to alternate between brand. This is actually a bad setup, but I hadn't, I couldn't find a good setup in our uh, guys here. I really wanted Lockyer's Loop to come, but he has Warren's Foe. And I'm not about to bring anyone with specific penalties. Our healer for today is Koshade, who's also a beast heat hater, so that's pretty good. And then he's got the Sacred Scroll and the Ancestor Scroll, all about the scrolls, and that's the sort of usual... Uh, the sort of usual... This is actually not that great. Let's see if we can find a better item for Mr. Koshade here. We can probably figure something out. Like, he, he's he got Beast Hater, which is nice. So I could go a little bit into but this one lowers his damage output. Right, so... Hmm. Could be this one here. Healing received. It's not a bad one to have around. I never use the angel ring because it's just... but mm, I guess it's pretty good, all things considered. Yeah, I think we'll try that instead. No malefic skull because it's not really made for bosses, though you could argue that it helps us get to the boss, but usually in the warrants, if I recall correctly, we get to uh, the boss relatively quickly. We can sort of beeline towards it. Alright, that's the setup. We need to go, I noticed, and upgrade stuff. So here, uh, is it just Koshade? Yeah, it's just Koshade. That needs upgrades. And we will, of course, not go without. I uh, will upgrade everything. Oh, hold on. Uh, I think I will upgrade this ability here for Keychain. Because I'm, I'm considering once we get to the boss, he will run a different setup here. Not Great Shotman, then probably Open Vein instead. It's at least a thought I had, and we will contemplate that once we get closer to the boss. Um, I really shouldn't. We should sell an item. Let's sell an item. Anything. Just a small thing that we aren't using. Like this one here could be the thing. The rampart shield. Sure. Okay. And then hope we make a lot of money from this mission here. And then we don't die. Full up on food. Ten torches. Three keys. Two holy water. Medicinal herbs. We already had some. We need three. About three. I'll take two of each of the bandage and anti-venom. 
We need three shovels to be on the safe side, though it's not that necessary in this dungeon. No laudanum. I almost forgot, but I had made... I had internalized the thought that we need the blood, and here we are. I'm just going to bring a whole stack of them. Let's go one down, because we probably won't. And then we have... Uh, we are able to stack an extra one in case we find one, and we will probably be drinking at least one, if not two, during the adventure. I think that's everything, and then let's just dive on into this mission. Did I forget anything? Everything I had managed to bring through was brutish and stupid. Moreover, it required prodigious amounts of meat to sustain itself. But this was only a trifling concern. After all, I had a village full of it. Yeah. Alright, so I just noticed one thing, and that is I don't... This abomination. A testament to my failures. It must be destroyed. We will try. I don't think that since I switched computer, I turned on... Oh, well, I certainly didn't. Extra bark time seconds. Just how long he will work when they show up. Oh. I like having them around a little bit uh, extra. Ah, oh, nice. Okay. Hardy auto sword. Debug auto. No, no, no. Okay, let's uh, save changes. Yes. Gameplay. What am I looking for? Subtitles. What is all of this? Okay, audio. Subtitles on. Bottom, top. I think bottom. And then this is all good. Save changes. I do like the subtitles, both for people who don't run sound and for myself to learn all the funny words that they say in this, dungeon, uh, in this game. So again here, like I said, we can sort of beeline towards the boss. I'm assuming that it's down here. So let's just dive. Let's go this way around just in case. And the boss might be over here. That's unlikely though. Am I missing anything? I still feel like I'm missing something. I'm forgetting something here. I don't know, man. This guy is a problem. Yep. Ooh. Hoo. Nice dazzling light. Let's see if we can stun him. Because if I recall correctly, he is just a beast of a character. Not like, literally and figuratively. So... Chop, can you one-shot anyone? Yes, you can. By all means, go for it. Now, we can't use the thing for you, but that's fine. The, oh, but you don't have anything else that you can affect them with. Right. So we'll do this one here and buff you up. And then you will have to brand someone. I should maybe... Oh, Vindicate can't be used in this spot. Oh, boy. I have definitely made some misplays then. All right, we will we will uh, be adjusting. So let's just still focus on this guy. So now you can't actually help in this combat. That's pretty bad. Why did I do the hue? Good question. Can we remove this thing here? Unlikely. Damn it. Judgment. Yes. Setting it up for Keychen to do his thing. So you can only brand. Or guard, that's fine, I suppose. Um, like he's got good crit chances, which is nice. Put your cut. Some damage coming in. Spit to roast. And, okay, that's not... Damn it. Um, bum, 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 bum. Yeah. No. Uh, protection. High protection here. That's unfortunate. We need to kill this guy. He needs to die. So, that's going to be the focus. And we're going to do chop, I think. Unless Hugh can kill one. It can't. That's a miss. That's the thing about not getting trinkets on to the leper, is that you don't get to boost his accuracy, which is annoying. Let's spend the bandage here, because we are getting into dangerous territory. You will buff yourself by using this one, so do it. 
shouldn't have done it on Huli, but whatever. Time to do some healing. Yes. Goring Flight. Okay, that worked out. We will suffer through that damage, I think. Now, chop. Go for this guy. Also, because Kitchen can only really affect the one in the front. Uh, we're going here again. Only seven. I was hoping for more. Do you have, like, less healing received or something like that? No. Why do you only get... Like, it says uh, eight to nine healing. So why would he get less? Yeah, I'm not sure. Hmm. Brand. Maybe you can kill him with a crit? Ah, oh, one damage remains. Or one HP remains. Okay. Now we want to win the initiative roll. We did, and we can kill him. And I don't think it's worth waiting in that scenario. Some nice loot. Oh, this was a pretty bad start for the run. This is a concern, but I can just switch over to Wrath, which can be used in spot 3. I think that's why I put him here, but then I realized we don't need the armor piercing against the boss. So... Oh, we could have used... Vengeance. Cauterize. Can cure bleed. Oh. Interesting. Like, would you rather have that? We don't have stress relief in this group. So we don't want to cause more stress to ourselves. All right. Yeah, we're pretty wounded already. Ah, he has like 50% less healing received. Oh, so is he. Okay. No. Oh. <laughs> All right, Caradox, you greedy bastard. You can keep it. I will eat some food here. I'm thinking, but I think everything's okay. We go in. Okay. Oh, they're surprised. Nice. I would go with, with stand, maybe? No. Let's try to finish this guy off fast. Or just not. God damn it. Um, can we stun the big guy? There's a chance, or even the oh infamous blood letter, infamous cut through. Uh huh. Well, what's your stun chance here? 140. So it's only 50 on him. It's almost 100 on this guy. Or we could heal. Let's stun a little bit. We're gonna need healing in a in a minute. Yeah, this doesn't really do any damage without the brand. So let's brand the big guy. Do we have anything that bypasses stealth on you? This one does, but can't hit spot number three. Good, a crit is good. That that gives us stress relief. I will focus on the big guy, even though we could hit the guy in the back with this thing. Masterfully executed. Nice. Blanket fire, we know that's one. Oh, but it missed. Sweet. Punishment. That sounds like it'll hurt. It did. Only a little bit, though. No bleed. No bleed. Nice. A shank. A shank. Also bleed. Okay. Lots of bleed going down. Now we can hit the guy who's stealth. It's not going to be a kill chance. You could purge the one in front, which has a higher hit chance and lowers or increases your accuracy over the fight as well. So I think that's the better choice. Now we can still hit him. No, let's go uh, do this advance and try to kill the big guy with a crit. Yeah, it's not enough. Having repost up is nice though. And then divine comfort. Now we get some proper healing out of that one. Rushed shot. Okay, and he gets to go back. Harmless poke. Because they were positioned incorrectly, which is nice. You can kill the big guy now, yeah, no problem. Can you kill this guy? No. Kill the big guy then. With a crit. 
The hue should be okay here. Has a kill chance at least. Didn't work. There's the blanket fire. But we have the post up and it failed. Oh well. I should always check these debuffs because that was what failed me before. But we have a group heal to counter the blanket fire. So I'm not that concerned. And we can... Nope. Kill that guy because he didn't move yet. It's either the brand or the other one and they do sort of the same damage when he isn't marked already. Kill him. Yep. Nice. Ooh. That's some loot there. I don't feel like I should use the bandage here. Um, we could eat the food. I feel like we'd be getting more food. We need money more than the heirlooms. So, portrait out. Medicinal herbs onto the table here. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. See, I would like to keep it, but it's likely that we get to use medicinal herbs later to get more food again. We could drop the anti-venom, because there's not a lot, now that I'm thinking about it. Eh, there's some, but the boss doesn't give you light, I think. Can't really use the torch. Let's do the scouting here. Okay. Well, I'm not going to discard the shovels. That's silly. I guess it's the crests that'll go, and I'll take the food to be on the safe side. I just want to make sure we get to the boss and kill him, rather than getting a lot of loot. Yeah. And we'll stay in the dungeon if we are uh, okay to continue after the boss. Yeah, we have to skip that one. Maybe we shouldn't loot now, then. That is an argument to be made. That's honestly interesting. Then I shouldn't have taken this path, but... I'll, I'll do it. There's a map inside. Okay. Oh, we didn't get the final one. But it must be down here. Where the boss is. Okay. Do we go for fight? Or for using the shovel while we have it? Like, we don't want to take battles unnecessarily. Well, there's a battle here, but with a treasure. So we are, we're gonna get one battle either way. This battle is likely a little, like, usually less concerning than the big battles in the rooms. That's not always the case, so that's sort of a moot point. I think this route is the better one for looting. And we can go and check those curios as well. Or we could go that way, then over here but now we're in a bad spot for exploring the rest of the dungeon, so I'll go here. This one works with a buff from... Right, this is a damage buff. I think you will take it... Yeah, damage until camp, yep. Right. We will probably not be resting before the boss encountered at this point. I will eat food so we make sure we have full health. Here's the blight. But it missed. Let's stun someone. Devastating blow. Nice. You're damned. Much. There's the blight. Yeah. Let's just use the anti-venom here. 61 crit. Right, because of the damage buff, so... Uh, chop this guy. Oh, but you failed. Damn. So now we'll brand him. Or brand the big guy. This one has armor piercing. And this guy has high prot. Let's try the chop on the guy in the back. Yep, it worked. Sweet. Do this advance. It's done. Ah, well, he had the buff, so. 
Never mind. Give them no quarter. Like we have seven stress between us right now. That's pretty amazing. Victory. But a victory nonetheless. Indeed. I would want the onyx here. I'm a greedy bastard. Okay. I... Okay. It is the boss. I will check these curios now, because we're not coming back this way. So just peek out. Okay, we will go for this thing. Oh, okay. That's actually helpful. And... We don't want the gold right now. So let's go back. Stop stepping on my feet. Before we go into the boss room, we should increase the light level. And I I have seen the trap, don't worry. Do you have... No. It'll be you. Kitchen. We skip this thing. This thing is a debuff from that. And then... Well... We could pour, try pouring blood on it. Didn't think it would do anything. Anti-venom? I don't think we need it in the boss fight. Let's just try it. Nah. The bandage, I believe he does bleed, this guy. So now we need to rework the skills. I don't want the grape shot in this fight. I want the open vein, if anything, to replace it. Here we will go with not you, but probably the self-heal in case you do hit the, the negative or the, the death store. Purge is fine. It's not super good. Not compared to... He could go buff, buff, and then start attacking, and then I want some solemnity. Then here we have... I think this is set up as fine. And you have the group heal, the single target heal. The stun I don't think does uh, anything to him. So let's replace it with... You can't do any of the other ones. So, what we have to keep in mind is that we might be pushed around. It happens. So we could put in a, a skill that she could use up front. That would be either the melee bash or... Huh. You buff yourself with this one. No. Bash. All right. Get to the door. Not a very dramatic door for a boss encounter. But then it's not supposed to give anything away. Let's go. Is struck. A blazing star is born. All the way up. And 3, 2, 1. Here we go. Final Swine King boss. It is a travesty. A blundering mountain of hatred and rage. Yep. Oh, and you stunned him. That's not good. Judgment. We can't. We are not allowed to hit Wilbur. He will go crazy. And if we kill Wilbur, even worse. No hitting Wilbur. Now, do we do five damage to him, or heal Caradox for two HP? Seven damage to him. And these two. All right, that's fine. We will use the buff first for the entire battle. And same with you here, you will buff yourself with the tanky buff first. Wild flailing. 13 only, ah. No bad no biggie. We can take that. Bit u squeal. A dizzying blow to body and brain. Eh, that's nothing. Okay, now we are gonna go point blank shot. 68 crit. Uh oh. Squeal. Okay, so he moves himself back. That's good. Now we are gonna brand the big guy. Nice, another crit. We could use the holy water. I should use the holy water on someone. Not 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 yet. Like okay, your chop chance is only 73, so if you miss with this attack. Having used the revenge would be better. 
right? If he even he if he just misses once, because this one buffs his accuracy for the rest of the fight. So I don't think it's even a question for a boss fight that how important that thing is. All right. I will do the group heal here. Even though we could have focused down Keychain's HP, spreading it out is better. Literate body, ouch. Bit of squeal. That's just a bit of horror. Uh, stress, that's fine. It was a stunching thing and it didn't work. He can be bled, right? Yeah, he can. Okay. This one does. Well, you know, the duelist. Let's put up the repose first. It is a boss fight. I think we're winning this one. No, no, no. Uh-oh. Oh no. Shit. <laughs> oh no. Okay. <clears throat> focus, focus. What do we do? Like, we can. St 144 hit points remaining. I'm gonna go a few rounds with this, but that's not good. I think we do have to f to uh, dedicated heal Keychain because Julie here can take it and has higher protection and stuff. He needs to stay alive with the reposts because that one will be retaliating every time he does that uh, party wipe ability. We cannot have a party wipe here. We cannot have a party wipe here. It's not good. I didn't think that through. Please kill him. No, we are dead. We are so dead. 24, 94 hit points remaining. Enraged destruction. Okay, we get to retaliate every time he does it. At least one more time, two more rounds. And he stunned the healer. Can you get anything out of drinking the... Yeah, okay. I'm not sure what it did, but it did something. And then I want to do holy water with you as well. He's down to 70. Down to 43. Down to 15. We can't kill him with this attack. Okay, we have to take one more hit then. Brand him. Please don't kill me. Oh, the repost might do it here. How many rats will it <sighs> a ton of putrid flesh? Oh, that was a misplay. Oh, man. Wow, I can't. Like, I don't know, man. That was... Oof. We made it. <laughs> um, I'm just so dumbfounded by my own inability to predict that outcome because it was so predictable. I was unlucky that a Wilper attacked him, right? But still, are we gonna go on here? And I think we are because we do have decent stuff and a group heal, a few group heals will get us going again if we should run into fights. Uh, there will be a fight here. We will run high light, and then we'll be we'll be okay. I'll eat some food with everyone. Just to stay a little bit on top of it. There's a trap here. All things considered, it was a pretty good fight for us. Uh, right, we we even I screwed it up, and we are still able to go on. I thought for a second we would lose it, though. That was. Could easily have gone completely wrong. Group heal. Compassion is a nice. In the fevered pitch of battle. Oh, you need to switch abilities again. Oh, he had exactly 41 hit points, so that was pretty uh, amazing. This one bypasses stealth. Vomit. 
should resist. Because he's got that extra stuff. Yeah, nice. And another one. Good on you, Huli, for just taking the heat. Hook where it hurts. No biggie. Vomit again. <laughs> Look at him tanking through the whole thing. Let's go for someone who didn't move yet. Kill chance. No kill chance here without a crit. Here we can do it with maximum damage. Didn't get it. Group heal. Now you go for a good old chop. Nice. Would have used a hue if I had the correct abilities assigned. Okay. Debuff. And a dodge. Nice. Kill the frontliner. Good old highwayman shenanigans. Now we do a dedicated heal here. And murder this thing. Sweet. Good. Brought low and driven into the mud. I think I will snatch snuff. Snatch. Snuff. Snuff out the torch. Here. The darkness holds much worse than mere trickery and boogeyman. Yeah. If only treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. And up here. Do we have a bandage? Oh no. Cochet you Oh. I was about to say, you lovely bastard. Of course. Oh, will we take this fight in the dark and gain a vampire? <laughs> uh, sure. Let's go balls to the wall here. I'm gonna rest in the treasure room we were just in with the campfire, so I'm not too worried. Can we finish off anyone? No, so... Probably best to just do the Divine Comfort. Murder the Frontliner if possible. Well, I should have attacked him anyway, it turns out. Oh, and I didn't redo the abilities. And now we're gonna get an Affliction, aren't we? Is that gonna be a kill? That was gonna be a kill, yeah. Raging Slight. No biggie. A good old chop. Has a kill chance. Oh, he hit. At 63% chance to hit, so... Well, that doesn't matter because it's gonna heal. Ah, well, not all that much. Okay. Uh-oh. Yep. Okay. Ah. Kishin doesn't miss. Stay on it. We'll bring it down. Uh, dedicated heal here, I think. Well, this is a kill chance. Okay, yeah. That was the right choice. Now we need to kill him before he spawns more enemies, which he can do. We've seen that recently. Oh, and he just removed him. Well done. And I, I know that he has a thing now and that's not going to help him. But... I would want... We're going for the loot now. That's why we're here. At this point. Good. Ooh. Yeah, that was worth it. Okay. So clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Book of Secrets. Interesting. This one is actually okay. 
like it's a good trinket but i'm thinking that some other trinkets might be better still it's pretty good um discount invitation i don't know i i always forget to check whether we need more of those so i don't know and we can't justify taking it based on that so i would want money instead of crests at this point and back we go because we're not going to continue here we'll go and rest and we'll get a what if we're ambushed like this? You could just turn around and walk the other way, you know? A moment of respite. A chance to steel oneself against the coming horrors. Uh, can we stress heal you somehow? We probably can. Yeah, this is the one we would want. Oh, it's only one person, one companion. Should work on you, though. If religious prevents nighttime ambush. Like, again, I think you are. All companions. If mortality debuff, we don't have that. Okay. Can we lower stress further? Self only. Oh. Ah, no. And this one, Gallows Humor. Do, 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 do. Yeah. No. And courage. Clean guns, yep. Reflection. It's a pretty good one. But I would rather lower stress on Caradox if we can. It just doesn't seem like we really can. Oh, okay. This one's pretty good. So he's not religious, but the other ones are. Yep. Rest. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted, and purpose is made clear. Okay, switching abilities around. On we go. I should have looted these chests before. The stop is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. Before uh, turning on the light, of course. We will even take this fight. Ah. Too bad. He didn't kill it with one shot. I am disappointed. Oh, very nice. That's disgusting. Good old purge. Looks cool as hell as well. Stun that guy who can spawn more enemies. Didn't work though. Raging slight. Don't move. Didn't. Nice. Kill him! Time for a good old hue. Yep. And then... Brand. Ah. Can we kill him? Yes. They make a very satisfying squeal when they die. precipitates a dizzying fall. Nothing there. And yes. Uh oh. Okay, surprise is good. No complaints. Uh we should do some healing here. You know, we could switch this one with her ring at the very least. That would, that's something I should have done right away. Well struck. Ooh, double crit. Down to 2 HP. Kill him. Good. Now we're leaving the good one behind, but he's also the toughest one to kill. 
so it's like so-so. Split the roast. Okay. Isn't spit roasting like a super dirty turn? I'm uh, not sure exactly what it means, but I believe I've heard it in a uh, <clears throat> dirty context. Go for the big guy. Okay, we need a dedicated heal on Mr. Caradox. Good. Yeah, a good old duelist's advance. And then he hits everyone else except him. Okay, time for some group healing. That's fine. Oh, craving. We just drank blood with you. So you had, I still don't like that mechanic. We just drank blood with him and we've done it twice while he's been uh, in the standard mode. And it hasn't done anything for us. By the way, when you get Crimson Cursed, it overrides the other diseases. So the swine head here now does nothing for him. So that's annoying. Ah, damn it. Cripple them. Okay, now we're taking some damage. This might be the final fight. There's no reason to push it. We're also running out of food slowly. Oh, I should have used the super ability here. The promise of safety. Uh, I will go for the group heal, but... I would have liked a dedicated heal as well. Can we kill him, please? Goring Light. That's annoying. Okay, let's do the thing here now. Just gonna check that there aren't any penalties to it. Oh, you're an angel. What are we looking at? Another fight there. Uh, let's do it. The darkness holds dominion. Black as death. Get rid of the medicinal herbs. Probably prioritize some something other than crests here. Like I know we need I know we need busts a lot, so let's take them. Check the curio here. Uh we just deleted the the thing for that one. I'm not sure I'm gonna take that fight in the next room yet. Oh. Okay. In radiance, may we find victory. <sighs> like I think we can do it. We have a, a problem though. We cannot switch this one over to you without destroying an item. We need the key in that room if we're going in. It'll be the jade. So, like that. And now we are gonna go in because I just deleted money for doing this. So, there's absolutely no reason to not go in now. Or, you know, I've sort of committed to it. That's the point. No one else has diseases, so the swine head won't help anyone. We can drink the blood. We can eat the food before we go in. It's probably we should we need to have enough food for one meal just in case, right? And that's uh, some some people are eating extra uh, and stress eater and 
some of them have other things. So, no, the tapeworm thing was gone, but it's gone. But meh, one, full, okay. Can definitely heal a little. Okay, that helped. Okay, we can deal with that, and especially if we surprise them. All right. Give it to me, I know you have it. Oh, oh. Julie. Oof, that's a kill chance. Damn it. All right, here's a group heal. Fifteen. That's not a lot. I think you focus him as well, because he's got protection. Vomit. Drums of debilitation. It's been a while. Okay, all good. Let's just go with the high percent chance, high hit chance per uh, percentage. Jesus, that was hard. About to break. Yes. Is it a kill chance? It is not. Is it a kill chance here? Nope. All right, we are. Mm, nope. Okay. Just step. Good old step step. We might get him with a hue. That was pathetic. Group heal. Ah, there we go. Temptation grows with each blow. All right. Chop. Bomb it. Now we have these guys in the back. Uh, that I was going to say with a, that are going to be hard to hit, but that helped. Keep group healing. Sedated. Shoot him. What do we even have that can hit them here? Um, you can. Okay, we got Grey Rot. I believe we've had that one before on Koshe, but it got healed. So Grey Rot, yeah, that's actually the one I like on our healer, so that's pretty good. Remove the bodies with you, and then set it up for Kitchen to murder them. 43. Very nice. And the body is still marked. Hmm. Group heal. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. It's actually not, because I'm doing healing all the time in battles, so... Joke's on you, Mr. Storyteller. Bam. More blood. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. Sweet. That means we can delete the shovel. Oh, this is an unlocked strongbox, right? And it's trapped. Perfect. There's a curio a hit. Let's just go and take it. Summer Trap. And we shouldn't normally take these things, but I guess Koshi does makes the choice for us. And yeah, curses. Alright, that is the dungeon for this today, folks. I could go for the fights here. This one fight. You know what? I'm I'm in a gaming mood today. I'll go for the fight. It will help our curve in the game as a whole. Need more money to get and general loot to get things done. 
You aren't getting any XP for this dungeon because everyone is already max level. And this will be the fight where we die, surely. No, it will not. I shouldn't have done I should have stunned, just in case they do something crazy with a... <laughs> a crit or something. He just out-damaged uh, the point-blank shot guy. Well, he did crit, so... But usually we only crit for like... 41 with a... point-blank shot, so... Oh, I've seen 61. Okay. Easy fight. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. <laughs> okay. As if on cue. Well done, Mr. Storyteller. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh no. And a fight. Oh, and the light has gone down. And these are pretty tough, so this could be a bad situation. Let's go with a buff for you. How? Okay. This is the fight where we die. Huh. Wouldn't that be something? I doubt it. Uh, this will be a dedicated heal for Karadox. And a stun on this guy. Nope. An attempted stun. Skull Toss has a stun thing as well. It didn't work. Nice. Behold the power of the blood. Oh, nice. Ah. Swing and a miss. Wrath. Heavenly wrath. Cripple them. Ow. Okay, let's please not lose a character here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Masochistic. No, Koshik, you, if you hit yourself now and die from this, I would never forgive myself for pushing the envelope. Come on, we just need one more good hit and then we're done here. It's not going to be you. That's a good hit, though. Good. Nice. All right. We made it. Ah, I forgot to turn down the light before we finished it. They can be beaten. Okay. Now we just need to take the stuff that will actually benefit us in the long run. I'll take the deeds instead, and then that is it. Shh. Okay. Ah. Misclick. I want to complete the quest. Daredevil, that's a good one. It's replaced Corvid's Resilience. That's not good. Stress. I don't think the Corvid's Resilience was a good thing. Uh, those like disease resist or something. Stress versus beast. Oh. Warren's foe. Well, we're not going to come back here a lot more. And love interest. <laughs> cool shit, you dirty bastard. This sucks. Supply quantities change by 50%. Provision quantity. So that means the next dungeon can only really be a short one. That sucks. Uh, let's check the stagecoach. Do we have a veteran sisters, a sisters thing? I think we do. We have Black Sheep, yeah. Who's missing at the moment? 
Let's check stress levels. I'm sure someone will want some stress relief. We just saw that Koshate has a new thing. She will only visit the brothel. Can we upgrade the brothel? No. Don't need to. Shatterthrax. Just checking that she isn't a vampire. She's not, so you can go in here. These two are vampires. They're not coming in here. But they might want to go to the abbey. Good. And then that's sort of it. The dart hitter is pretty bad. We could remove it. I want to make sure we remove something every episode. Hemophilia, not that bad. Swing guard. Rabies. Uh, extra damage is fine. Pudding head. Nope. Doesn't matter. Wake Kingdom. Rabies. We have a few with that, I think. Tapeworm. Doesn't matter. So let's find a... Ooh, Eldritch Tater is something we could lock in. And Tough as well. Well, Adventurer. You know what? Ernie here. He will become an Eldritch Hater early on. Oh. Torn Rotator is something we want to remove for you. Because you only have melee skills. Okay. Then that's sort of it for this episode. So thank you guys for watching. And see you in the next one. Bye bye.